first things that, um, you know, basically, uh, that captivated me about Anna was her beautiful eyes, you know. Um, and if anybody's seen them, you know, you, you look into her eyes and it's almost like you can feel what type of person she is. I guess I first noticed him when he was kind of eyeing me out. I don't know, made me kind of feel really pretty because he'd always see me, I guess. And um, he was just really persistent and I noticed his smile. His smile was the first thing I noticed about him. To be honest with you, uh, I'd heard the guy she was dating wasn't the right guy for her, and I know what type of man I was raised to be and what man you know I want to be. And I, I saw an opportunity to uh, get to know her better um, through work. And uh, one of the things we we did when she did break up with her boyfriend was if I heard a song, you know, I would text it to her and I'd say, "Hey, listen to this song. You know, this is how I feel about you." things like that and she would do the same thing I'm standing where the lightning as silly as it may sound he asked Jordan and I out on a first date and let Jordan pick and we went over to the Japanese steakhouse in Joplin and then um, on our second date I was cooking dinner and he was gonna go get a movie but instead of just going to pick out a movie he came over grabbed Jordan real quick just walked in the house and was like hey bub let's go get a movie real quick so they went and grabbed a movie and it just, it was really natural and it, to me, just kind of clicked right then. It was kind of history. You, but it's all in my head. Ask me anything you want to. Honestly, yes, I think I knew it right away. Um, I mean, that's really all I can say about it. And then after I met Jordan, just being caught up in your eyes. he's such a good kid, you know. I just wanted to be a good father figure to him. I just, you know, I would do my best to raise Jordan to be the best man that he can be. I'm standing where the lightning strikes. I know this doesn't happen twice. You must be my once in a I thought all day about texts that I wanted to send him and something I wanted to say to him and just see him really quick and just you know, stop in a moment and take that time just to tell him how much he means to me and how much this day actually means to me. I just want to ask, can we make this moment last? So before the storm is past, I will continue to hold her hand through the ups and downs, the trials and tribulations, the hurdles, pitfalls, the storms, all that. We'll be in the same boat together and we'll fight and we'll overcome and, um, and we, I think we're going to be happy for the rest of our lives. Don't you know you stop the really truly been blessed to have him in my life you know, with Jordan. Jordan's blessed as well. I mean, we've just, it's too good to be true. I feel like God put us together and we're soulmates and I feel like that's what it is.